10, we ain't Shanlin I do 50k, I ain't say cause it was easy Pretty girl, where you stay? Might as well be with me Good morning, it's day two. Day one was so long, but so much fun. I ended up meeting up with my friend Mary Chris and she was so clutch. She let me drop off my luggage at her house and then she took me out and kind of toured me around and we explored different parts of both Brooklyn where she lives and Manhattan and then eight came back over here. By the way, the coffee place that we went to, or the brunch place that we went to, had bomb coffee. So, speaking of coffee, that's actually what I'm about to do right now, is go scour for some coffee. There's like tons of places around, so I think the one that I want to try today is La Cologne. And yeah, I'm excited. I'm tired. I came back and crashed, and 
woke up at like 10 something almost 11 <laughs> uh, by the housekeeping knocking on the door and yeah i could have definitely slept more so i don't know today i'm gonna kind of pace myself um and just kind of explore i want to do a lot of like parks and outdoor stuff we did go to a couple of parks which was great um but yeah time to go get coffee <laughs> You guys got the good playlist. <laughs> Thank you. I'm back to the room to drop off some stuff and get this bag so that I could carry more stuff. The little one just wasn't cutting it with my camera and everything. And then I just wanted to put on a t-shirt because it is kind of like overcast outside you can't really tell and my hair just wasn't cooperating with me the baby hair is the everything so bandana it is <laughs> all right now i'm gonna go explore <laughs> Nice. Yo, I'm really in New York. That's crazy. So right behind me is the edge. For some reason they said that it's temporarily closed. I don't know if that's true. So I'm guessing maybe you can't climb it. I've heard that people try to do, people try to unalive themselves there. So that might be why they closed it down. Uh, but you, there's still people like walking around it, so I'm gonna walk into it. I think we just can't climb to the top, basically. I think that's why they say it's temporarily closed.
I would have walked all through from University, Fremont, Newark, San Leandro at this point. <laughs> I walked so much today and yesterday. Whew. But it's like so much scenery, but like it, I don't even realize how far I'm walking. I've walked so many miles. I'm sure this is probably going to be the last stop before I go back to the hotel because my back is starting to hurt from walking so much. Like I thought I was a walker, but like, man, the amount of walking that I've been doing today is just unmatched. It's gonna be the last stop and then I'll do something later. I'll figure out what I'm gonna do tonight. I'm gonna charge up my phone and take a little break, a little, little quick cat nap before I finish up tonight. But so far, so good, I'm enjoying it. I just found this cute area on West 22nd Street and stumbled upon it and started taking pictures of myself and it was so awkward but then at the same time nobody was paying attention to me <laughs> to go back and change and get ready for that so that uh, I'm not gonna lie I'm kind of tired from already walking everywhere and hiking everywhere <laughs> but I haven't worked out at all besides walking so I'm like okay let's, why not why not go on a nice little run and I'll get to see more of the city that way anyways <laughs> go that way Excuse me. Yes. yes. Definitely. Sorry. Definitely. I don't know if it's just because like I'm not from here, so I don't really care, or if everybody around me just is used to it and doesn't care. But um, but I find it easier to vlog. <laughs> oh, you can't even see. What's Boy. up, vlog? <laughs> Out here running. It wasn't even my idea this time again. Again, I tell you guys. Thank you. 
definitely just entered at the wrong subway entrance. <laughs> so now I just paid basically for nothing because I have to hop right back off. Luckily, I didn't actually get on the train, but yeah, so this is the one that I'm supposed to go on. <laughs> I swear, it's so like, there's so many different routes and exits and stuff that it gets like confusing for which one is which. And it's getting hot, so I have to take off the jacket. Round two. This park is too big. I had to come all the way back to try to get the bike rental thing, but as I'm looking inside there, I kind of want to go inside too before I hop on the bike. It's just like, I don't even know if I'm gonna make it to the Met. <laughs> Cause I was gonna try to go to the Met since I'm over here. But I don't even know if I have enough time. There's just so much stuff going on. Let me try to climb up here first, take a picture, and then I'm gonna try to bike. up at Times Square walking back to the hotel. This is my final night of saying my goodbyes. It's been pleasant. It's been nice. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I feel like I mastered the subway now. <laughs> okay, mastered is a stretch. Not mastered, but I feel like I've definitely adapted and gotten better. I don't know. Late night adventures. But yeah, Times Square reminded me a lot of uh, Vegas, like the Strip, just with more people, um, but it was nice, it was, 
I don't know if I would say nice. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. It's a lot, but I it's kind of what I expected. Like it's a very big touristy attraction. So a lot of heads, but I'm so glad and thankful for my friend for taking me. I know she doesn't like going there. I did not sign up for the rain. No. 